Why are weapons manufacturers targeting British children? As part of a marketing drive, weapons manufacturer BAE Systems are targeting children by supplying schools with branded fairy tales for years five and six. The company are also providing schools with branded learning materials for children as young as five to do at home during lockdown. The UK government even chose BAE Systems to be the sponsor of a failing academy school. The weapons that BAE produces have been used in conflict zones around the world. It has armed and supported some of the most abusive regimes in the world, enabling them to inflict terrible atrocities and abuses against their own populations and those in other countries. None of these awful realities will be included in their lessons plans or propaganda. Right now, BAE's fighter jets are playing a central role in the Saudi-led bombing of Yemen. This has helped to create the worst humanitarian crisis in the world and has seen the destruction of schools and deaths of thousands of school-aged children. This is not a fairy tale. This is real life and these are the consequences of its arms sales. Will I live or not, asks this boy. He can't be more than about 12 years old. Another company, Talis, which sells arms to regimes such as Saudi Arabia, the United Arab Emirates, Egypt and Kazakhstan, run branded activities for children, including a missile simulator. And Raytheon, manufacturer of the Paveway 4 missiles currently being used by Saudi Arabia in Yemen, run an annual drone building competition for children in UK schools every year. MDBA, another major supplier of missiles to Saudi Arabia, run Robot Rumble, a robot building competition for children aged 13 to 14. When you fund fun activities for young people, they will have fun, they will be with each other and they will benefit from that. But that doesn't have to be under the umbrella of a military ethos. Arms companies don't care about our children's education. They use schools to try and sanitise their brands and whitewash the atrocities that they enable. If you think that weapons manufacturers should stay out of our schools, please share this video and help spread the word.